pretty psyched about this. And so now, now we yeah. have Velocity on both coasts. Yeah. October in Midtown on Manhattan. The variety of technologies that today's web engineers are expected to understand is really growing. And so there is a persistent need to go to Velocity and learn about these technologies. I've been very happy pushing out code fast. Um, the time from when I write the feature to when it's live is low. That's why con continuous deployment is great for me as a developer, right? That's what I wanted. We decided that we would have to build a DNS load balancer, which we call Cartographer. The reason we partition these two things apart is because if there is failure in our offline code independencies or our logic falls over, we still serve a response. The response might be delayed in time and might be based on previous network conditions, but it's better than serving no, res no response at all going to be another tremendous slate of speakers. He'll give this overview of the schedule and the speakers, and I'm just floored. I mean, it's so good. Yeah, it's going to be another tremendous show. Whether icons imply an inexact science, whether as a metaphor implies this is a prediction and this may be wrong. And so the customer understands that you understand that uh, let the end user know that it was a subjective metric. If the machine of web operations is not working, there needs to be an individual component which is not working. It seems that the most unreliable component of web operations is often constructed to be well, you guys. <laughs> the people who are building these websites have a lot of responsibility on their shoulders. And so it's important that you know, we all share these best practices and make those websites as strong and as fast as we can. New York, see you.